So here I am outside the Swift Car and Ag and X and this building right behind me is the Palliser Pavilion which is where Brad Wall will be coming tonight once he knows the results. Whether it is a victory speech obviously that's yet to uh, be told that story but I'll take you inside to some of the setup. It's roughly three o'clock so we have another five hours before the polls close when I'm filming this and right now all it is is plenty of setup so I will take you through and you can have a, a taste of what we see before all the events go on. So it takes you through, you'll be able to get drinks tonight if you are a SAS party supporter and you go through and in front of you there you can see the numerous tables where supporters will begin to gather balloons are up already the podium where Brad Wall will actually take to whether it's victory speech again or not is here we have massive screen TVs that's the podium where he will be doing his speech from and then again the flags TV screens. Now in terms of the setup that all the media go through, as you can see, that is where the media is. Our table right here and some of the work that we do and the equipment. And then if we span around, the guys at the table there are the experts who actually have the microphones and the wiring for the speeches to take place. And then if you look all the way at the back here, that's where all of the TV coverage goes on and all the various media outlets have their spot. And that is the room where everything will be going on this evening. And I'll just spin just a little faster back to the podium. And if you take a look up above Brad Wall, there we go what they assume will be victory balloons that will be dropped I'm sure at the end of his speech one dud one there in the middle so five hours to go there's still plenty still plenty going on yeah. and I'll be uh, right here in this room from now until when it's all over so but that's what's going on right now